wait a minute. Okay, he came and worshiped. So then, then I come to find out in Matthew, now y'all stay with me here, this is going to bless you. Now Matthew recounted a whole different story. In the book of Matthew, you got two disciples with Jesus on this day. Mark says, I saw one man come down and worship Jesus. Now, Matthew tells it, there were two men. Y'all stay with me. There were two men that were living amongst the tombs that were possessed by devils. And those two men came down. So, so I begin to think, which one is it? is it? Is it two men? You got two of the disciples of Jesus, each in this arena, and they're telling two different stories. Mark sees one man, Matthew sees two. Okay, Mark sees one man, Matthew sees two. Y'all with me? Yeah. Now, would that bother you like it bothered me? So here's the deal. When he came to worship at the feet of Jesus, now I'm not saying this is scriptural, I'm just saying I'm proposing a thought to you today. Okay? Because Matthew is like, let me really break it down. Matthew is like, okay, I'm seeing two. And in and, 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 and today's terminology, we would call that sometimes maybe, maybe I, I'm seeing a two-faced person. Uh-oh. Mm-hmm. And maybe, just maybe, listen, it was one person acting two different ways. Uh-oh. Oh, see, I'd never read it like that before, Pastor Randy. And maybe God will use one of you to bring the other you to Jesus. Uh-oh. See, I can just shut church down right now. Maybe, just maybe, Phyllis, God will use the, the worshiping you to reach out and bring the whip and nene and stanky leg you to Jesus. Come on. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Amen or ouch. Maybe, just maybe, God will use the Sunday morning you to bring the Friday night you to Jesus. Uh-oh, I'm preaching right now.